this is biotechnica and you're listening to india's first life science podcast the voice of biotechnica news views and reviews opinion and opinion makers policy critics and policy makers now all on one integrated biotech platform the voice of biotechnica launched on biotechnica's 12th birthday the voice of biotechnica is going to be your voice we will discuss the latest innovations talk about the bright side of life science sector and debate on the darkest side of research our experts will take you on a ride to the deepest secrets of life sciences the voice of biotechnica a weekly podcast released every week on wednesday so what are you waiting for listen to the podcast and voice your opinion too want to talk about something you think is relevant contact us today via email info at biotechnica.org hello and welcome to the dynamic world of biotechnica podcast bermuda triangle mystery finally resolved yes this is it and this is priyantana ghosh and today we will be exploring a lot of untold stories myths and mysteries regarding the most talked about of bermuda triangle which is well known for its paranormal activities and disappearances but apart from that the most exciting thing which we are going to listen is the mystery has finally been resolved by a group of scientists so how did they do this miracle we are going to listen okay so as we all know that bermuda triangle is a devil's triangle the area features multiple shipping lanes and has claimed over about 1000 lives in the last 100 years just imagine so first we are going to focus that what were or the mysteries of bermuda triangle the mysteries of bermuda triangle might be finally explained with the 100 feet rogue wave theory but the myth of its seas will definitely survive forever you will all agree but how all these tales and legends begin its abnormalities were first noted in the year 1950 by edward jones writing for the miami herald before it gained notoriety in 1952 when george sand wrote in faith magazine about certain incidents that occurred in that zone Another thing was that one of the most famous example which we all know I guess a flight of 19 a training flight of five torpedo bomber planes all five of the aircraft vanished during a training session in the year 1945 Following this many disappearances of planes or ships were reported and the mystery continued growing ever since Researchers and scientists have come up with an array of theories to explain this mystery disappearance. So some we'll see that some not so successful stories also are there that also try to resolve this mystery. And some of them were a methane gas story. Now this theory blames that the gas trapped under the sea floor for the scores of plane and ship disappearances and this the claim goes can erupt lower the water density and cause the ships to sink like a rock even planes flying over it could catch fire and get completely destroyed the researchers said regarding this theory next another not so successful story that also tried to resolve the mystery was the electronic fog theory and this is the name that coined for what is essentially a storm the electronic fog would appear from nowhere and would engulf a plane or a ship by causing all instruments malfunction so the ship or aircraft would vanish with no trace the next theory which we will be discussing is hexagonal cloud and air bombs It's another interesting theory that was proposed by some group of discoverers but it somehow failed to prove the mystery of Bermuda Triangle and that theory was hexagonal cloud and air bombs 
So this theory of Bermuda Triangle involved strange 45 feet waves. So meteorologists have discovered strange hexagonal clouds that are capable of blasting winds to the ocean below at huge speeds. And these wind storms on the ocean would create waves as high as 45 feet, decimating the ships and planes caught in it. But now, finally, we have the mystery resolved. So some of the experts at the University of Southampton believe the mystery can be explained by a natural phenomenon known as rogue waves. And the rogue waves which only last for a few minutes were first discovered by satellites in 1997 off the coast of South Africa. And Dr. Simon Boxall, an ocean and earth scientist, said that the infamous area of the Atlantic Ocean and what is that infamous area? The infamous body of water is the western part of the North Atlantic Ocean that stretches 700,000 square kilometer between Florida, Bermuda and Puerto Rico. In the Atlantic, we can see three massive storms coming together from different directions. And the perfect condition for a rogue wave is just this one. That is formation of these three massive storms. And Dr. Simon also believed that such a surge in water could snap away a boat. So he also added that there are storms to the South and North Atlantic Ocean which will come together and if there are additional ones from the Florida, it can be a potentially deadly formation of the rogue waves. They are stiff, they are high and they have measured waves in excess of 30 meters. So finally, we can conclude that yes, the mystery of this Bermuda Triangle has been finally resolved. But we will be leaving with a question in our mind definitely. That scientists have recreated the same situation of the Bermuda Triangle as a mock session using an indoor stimulator and showed that how huge boats can be overcome or overcoming the monster waves. But the question is whether this solution provided by the scientists, can it be a saviour? So let's wait for the actual success in reality, what say? So that's it to, for today friends and let's take a boat ride to the devil's triangle, what say? So thanks a lot, we'll come back with some more exciting news in our next session. Keep tuning to Biotechnica Podcast. Thank you.